E and the here day eight for this forest of outlaws of Thunder Junction. Leave me a comment. What do you think about loot the key to everything? Is he a Pokemon version of the Magic Multiverse? Who knows? Anyway, let's start. And I want to start from where I left yesterday, the big score, a set of 30 cards, all standard legal. Don't forget, you can play these cards in standard. These were originally planned in Epilogue Boosters, but got scrapped and added to the list after the mess of March of the Machine, the aftermath. Lost Jetty, finally a new Jetty, for one generic mana, legendary artifact equipment, whenever equipped creature this combat damage, put a charge counter on it, remove a charge counter from it, choose one, untap target land, target creature can block this turn, put a plus one plus one counter on equipped creature, equip for one. Hostile Investigator 3 and 1 black for 3 enters the battlefield, target opponent discards a card. Whenever one or more players discard one or more cards, investigate. This ability triggers only once each turn. Send Storm Scrapper for 2 and 1 green, 1-1, one, one. enters the battlefield, create a 3-3 three, three colorless golem artifact creature token. 2. Tap. Put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on each creature token you control. They gain trample until end of turn. Tarnation Vista Land enters the battlefield tapped. As it enters, choose a color. Tap, add one mana of the chosen color. For one, tap. For each color among mono color permits you control, add one mana of that color. Harvester of Misery 3 and 2 black 5 4 with menace enters the battlefield. Other creatures get minus 2 minus 2 until end of turn. For one and one black, discard it. Target creature get minus 2 minus 2 until end of turn. Collector's Cage for 1 and 1 white artifact, hide away 5, for 1 tap, put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on target creature control, then if you control 3 or more creatures with different powers, you may play the exile card without paying its mana cost. Bristle Bat Farmer for 2 and 2 green, 5 5 with trample, enters the battlefield, create 2 food tokens, whenever it attacks, you may sacrifice a food, if you do, mill 3 cards, you may put a permanent card from among them into your hand. Gamble of Greed, 3 and 1 black, enchantment, enters the battlefield, draw 3 cards, gain 6 lives and create 3 2 1 black bat creature tokens with flying. At the beginning of your end step, discard the card, lose 2 life and sacrifice a creature. When it leaves the battlefield, discard 3 cards, lose 6 life and sacrifice 3 creatures. Molten Duplication for 1 and 1 red, sorcery, create a token that's a copy of target artifact or creature you control, except it's an artifact in addition to its other types, it gain haste until end of 10, sacrifice it at the beginning of the next end step. So that was the last card in this particular day 8 of the spoilers of Outlaws of Thunder Junction, join me again tomorrow because we will have more and more spoilers about this western set, and as always don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more and more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the Collectible World.